Welcome to Global Black History. Please click below to subscribe to our channel. Today we are going to focus on the significance of the Johnson Publishing Building in Chicago. The Johnson Publishing Building in Chicago is a significant landmark in the city. It is also a symbol of African American achievement and entrepreneurship. It was a crowning achievement for the descendant of slaves to build a building that stood in the beautiful Chicago skyline. Founded in 1942 by John H. Johnson, the building housed the headquarters of Johnson Publishing Company. Johnson published Ebony and Jet magazines. These magazines were essential reading for African Americans during the Jim Crow era and helped to shape the way that black people were seen in mainstream America. More importantly Jet and Ebony changed the way that black people around the world saw themselves. The pride that people of African heritage had when they saw themselves represented on magazine cover cannot be quantified. The impact of the Ebony and Jet magazines gave African Americans a voice and a platform to be heard. Second, it showed the world that African Americans were just as talented and intelligent as any other group of people. Finally, it helped to break down barriers and stereotypes that had been preventing African Americans from achieving success in various areas of life. Thanks to the magazines, African Americans were able to gain a newfound sense of pride and confidence, which led to many great accomplishments in the years that followed. It is one of the few buildings in Chicago that was constructed with the intention of housing an African American commercial enterprise, and it was designed by an African American architect by the name of John Matusami. He was the first African American architect to design a high rise building in Chicago. It is an impressive illustration of mid century modern architecture, and the fact that it has sleek lines and a jet black facade helps it to stand out among the other buildings that are located on Michigan Avenue. Johnson Publishing was a great American story but their demise is rooted in their failure to adapt to technology. The world was changing and Ebony and Jet kept focusing on print media instead of going online. The failure has several repercussions including the sale of the building, a landmark for black people and a source of pride. The building was initially sold to Columbia College and then to 3L, a real estate developer that has converted it to apartments. The real estate company stated that the Johnson Publishing Company sign with logo and flagship magazine names would remain located atop the building. Johnson Publishing was one of the most important African-American-owned businesses in the country, and played a key role in shaping the way that black people were seen in mainstream America. The Johnson Publishing Company building was designated a Chicago landmark on December 13, 2017. Johnson Publishing Building stands as a stark reminder that a black man once did great things. He built a legacy of entrepreneurship which exceeded Jet and Ebony and has touched millions of people of African heritage. Thank you for watching. Please click below to subscribe to our channel.